Hi children. Good afternoon. How are you all? I hope all are fine. Okay children. Children, today I am going to start new lesson. The name of lesson is the thief. The thief means stoler. Okay. Thief means stoler. In this lesson, we see new friend. His name is Manu. Manu is telling his story. Who stole the baby's bird from the nest? Okay. Yes, see here, children. In this picture, we see Manu. Yes, yes, no, children. Next. It was a Sunday morning. After breakfast, Manu walked out of his house. He walked across the field to the river. One day morning, it was Sunday. Manu had his breakfast and he went out of his house and he was walking across the river bank. Okay, children. Next, on the river bank, there was a big mango tree. Manu climbed off the tree. He saw a bird's nest. It was at the end of a branch. The branch was high above the water. Manu saw two brown eggs in the next. Near the bank of the river, there was a mango tree. Okay, children. Which tree was there? There was a mango tree. And Manu climbed there. Tree. Manu climbed that tree and then he saw bird's nest. Okay, children, see here. This is a bird's nest. Okay, this is a bird's next nest. He saw bird's nest. In that nest, there was a two brown eggs. There was, see there, children. In the nest, there was a eggs. No, the tree branch of the nest was very high okay the tree branch of the nest was very high then manu took the eggs put them in his pocket then he started climb down he put his foot on on branch below but he slept he slipped and fell into the river manu taken the eggs Put them in his pocket and he came down from the branch. When he kept his foot on the branch below, he slipped and fell into the water. Okay, children. Next, see ya. In this picture, we see Manu fell into the water. Yes, no, children. Next. Now, in the river, there was a big crocodile. It caught Manu's leg. Manu gave a cry of pain. The crocodile followed him down under water. No sound came out of Manu's mouth. In the river, there was a big crocodile. Okay? In the river, there was big crocodile. It caught Manu's leg. When it caught his leg, it was very pain. Yes, no, children. See here, in this picture, we see crocodile and Manu. Crocodile is full of the Manu's leg. Yes, no, children. See here. When it caught his leg, it was very pain for Manu. Okay. He tried to come outside, but he couldn't. Okay, next. The, the crocodile followed Manu down and down and down. At last, Manu saw a big palace. An angry king sat on a throne. You are a thief, said the king. You stole the four bird's eggs. I will punish you. The, when the crocodile followed him under the water and there was a no sound come out of Manu's mouth. Then the crocodile followed Manu deep into the river. At last, Manu saw a big phallus. In the water, Manu saw a big phallus. In that, an angry king sat on a 
throne okay children in the water manu saw a big phallus and angry king sat on the throne okay then the king said to manu you are a thief the king said to manu you are a thief you stole the poor bird's egg so you will be punish you okay then then he couldn't speak a word oh crow said the king give this thief 20 lashes on his back with your tail the crocodile moved forward it lifted its tail to strike at manus back a sharp cry came out of manus mouth just then manu woke up it was only a dream when the the king said to manu you will finish for uh, your you will finish for this then manu get fear by listening the words punishment he couldn't speak a word also then the king said to crocodile to give 20 lashes it means the crocodile beats by its tail okay lashes means the crocodile beats by its tail okay then the king said to crocodile to give 20 lashes with its tail then the crocodile moved forward to punish manu by its tail then manu started crying by crying he he woke up from his dream and he thought it's not a true it's a dream okay children the moral of the story is we should never stole the things which belongs to others if we stole means we will be punished from the god thank you children